People are like, embrace the beauty that, you know, God gave you. And I'm like, no. I'm Adam Rippon, Olympic medalist, and I'm gonna be going through my beauty transformation, my growing glow. This is me trying to embrace who I really thought I was, but didn't have to be, I later found out. This was basically my segue into crazier hairstyles. Backstreet Boys meets NSYNC meets um, mental breakdown. I do have natural curls and um, I figured out that um, it doesn't need to be that way. <laughs> Wait, can we, why, why do I look like that? I thought I was pretty. But whatever, I'm gonna talk about my brows because I don't wanna focus on not having a chin or a neck. My eyebrows naturally are like only colored from here and then the rest, my body's just like, just make it see-through. Why did only half of my eye deserve to be covered? That wasn't fair. So then I went in to my local nail salon because they said that they do dyeing and waxing and I said, do it. So then she did it and I was like, you changed my life and it only cost like $50. And I've never looked back. That is the face of a boy who messed up. This is the first time I ever had like a straightening treatment and it wasn't a Brazilian blowout certified by the Brazilian Blowout Federation. This was one of those like olive oil things that you get at like CVS. I used it and yeah, my hair was straight, but if I pulled on it, it literally just came out of my head and turned to straw. That's not my natural hair color. I'm not a natural chocolate cocoa brown. You don't realize how blonde you are unless you go dark and then nothing else like on your body matches. Okay, this was a mistake. <laughs> I'm so sorry I did that to myself. Okay, I liked this a lot. Yeah, I was super into this. And so this actually sort of like killed my curls and made my hair wavy, which I was like, this is fantastic. Some days I wake up and I'm like, I miss it. But then I also like on the same token, I like don't miss washing my hair in the shower and like clumps of it falling out which did happen. I might be embarrassed at what I've done to myself, but I'm not ashamed. Like I know through like all of these photos, like no matter how bad they are, at, at this point in time, I thought I was gorgeous.